Kia ora, welcome back to the Queenstown Wanaka Weekly Mountain Update. My name is Nick Hine. This week we're reporting in from Kadrona where it is Bluebird. That's right, it is nice to see some sun after last week's insane snowstorm. Coronet Peak Remarkables and Kadrona all open. Snow Farm, the cross country skiing just across the valley from here, and Shevel Cone both scheduled to open on Friday, which is Matariki. That is a public holiday here in New Zealand to celebrate the start of the Māori New Year. There's plenty going on in town for that. Lots of events in Queenstown and Wanaka and up at the resorts. If you're heading up to the resort, don't forget that you can catch the bus from town. Also, there's some carpooling going on. If you'd like to be in the top car park, single parent families, or if you put three more in a car, you get priority. So let's have a look what's coming up in the next seven days. To Triple Cone, well they are opening a day earlier than scheduled. That's right, this Friday, Matariki, 24th of June, Triple Cone is going to open. Just keep an eye on their website if anything changes operationally there. They've had a lot. Two metres in the saddle and a metre at the bottom. They're going to be open top to bottom. Should be an opening day for the record books. To Kadrona, well I can tell you the snow is dry and chalky up here. A metre base all over the mountain. McDougal's, White Star and Captain's all open. And they've got the McPark 4.0 open. So they've got some beautiful rails, boxes and some new jumps even for the intermediate riders to try up here. This Sunday, 26th of June, is Mountain Bikes on Snow. Wild, wild event. Very exciting to watch, even crazier to be in it. So keep an eye on that this Sunday. To Coronet Peak, well Coronet Peak is open and loaded, maybe the most loaded it's been on an opening day for over a decade. Meadows, Coronet Peak Express and Green Gates and the T-Bar all open. The first night ski is happening tonight, that's Wednesday 22nd of June. Heidi's Hut is opening on Thursday if you want to go over there and grab a mulled wine. And this Friday for Matariki, special event, head to the top of the mountain with an astronomy expert at 6am to see the star constellation. To the Remarkables, well the Remarkables has been set up beautifully for the season. The Beginners Terrain Park has got a lot of nice features in, some boxes and some smaller jumps in there. Super fun to ride top to bottom, that's on Sugar Chairlift. Ultra is also open and curvy, beautiful start to the season. To Halley Ski, well Halley Ski season is here, that's right, get onto the operators websites, book that dream trip because to ride untouched powder, now's the time. Onto the weather forecast now, well it is going to be fine and frosty tonight through Thursday and Thursday night as well. On Friday a little bit of a northwesterly develops, that's going to bring some precipitation on Saturday. Might not be snow below 2000 metres but keep an eye on it. Sunday is eyeing up to be a perler, a little bit of cloud around but definitely the pick of the week. Winds are picking up early next week into Monday where we're going to see a cold front come across the southern ocean and that should give some nice top ups to all of the southern ski fields. Thank you for tuning in, that's us for another week. Until next Wednesday, I've been Nick Hines signing off from Kadrona for Mountain Watch. <laughs>